Well, on today's episode of Fix It, we're actually just replacing it. So on this episode of Replace It... I show Aaron and young Shay how to rebend some hydraulic lines and do a nice double flare on those bad boys. So this line connects the master cylinder to the slave cylinder. Pressure through this line allows the slave cylinder to separate the engine and transmission by disengaging the pressure plate from the flywheel. This is crusty and gross and old. I don't want to put pressure through this line and this rubber hose break, and then I get brake fluid everywhere. Yeah. What we're going to do is we're going to flare the end of this tube first, and then we're going to bend her. And then we're going to put these nuts on. We're going to flare the other end. That's right. Shay? Yes. <laughs> So what we're gonna do first is we're gonna take a file. So we're gonna put our little clamp in here. So now we've got the edge of that, and we're gonna use the file on the back of that. We're gonna use the file on the back of that, just to make sure that it's true and straight. Imagine that in your teeth. Why would I imagine that in my teeth? <laughs> Would you rather that or like rip your fingernails out and then pour salt into it? You're just describing torture methods. Would you rather have your guts removed or listen to this? <laughs> guts removed. So, let's put a flare on here. We have this die, we'll line it up, and then we'll tighten these down. And then this goes over the top. Camera point of view. We tighten it down and back it up. I use my Eastwood brake bender to get it out. We're gonna put this back on it again. We'll squish it out, and a double flare. Wow. Wow. Oh so now what we're gonna do is we're gonna bend this pipe into the profile-ish of this pipe. Oh, you got muscles, Ed. What? <laughs> now we've got it sort of close. We're gonna cut it. So to do this, you just put the pipe in there, tighten it down a little bit. Young Shay holds onto that end, and we just spin it around. And then a little bit tighter, spin it around. And then you keep doing this until it decides to do that. Now we're gonna slip on our nuts. Sick. Sick. Tight, bro. So now, Aaron. Oh, boy. Young Shay is <laughs> I'm like sweating like, a large amount of sweat. All right, there. put this hootus and this dingus right here. <laughs> hootus and the dingus. It's not fitting. You think, you think you're gonna beat Young Shay on first try? Oops. Hi. Oh, sorry. I got excited. You're going the wrong way. I'm just, I tried both. <laughs> I tried both ways. So I think I, bro I messed it up. You messed it up. You <laughs> betcha. This dingus and this hootus right here. Oh. I like how it didn't work, so you just forced it till it did. <laughs> yeah, so see how it's kind of mushed it? Yeah. It's because you weren't on it. Right. You weren't centered right. That looks like ass. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> a B? It's close. It'll be a B on that? It might leak, but we'll try it. <laughs> Is it gonna work? We're gonna find out. Are we gonna die? Buddy, who knows? I bet you'll have fun redoing it. So we're in selfie mode. But what we've done is we have installed the lines that Young Shay <laughs> and Aaron assembled. So what we're gonna do is show you that. There's that top line connected to the flex line that runs back behind the block and down to the clutch slave cylinder. Follow it, follow it, follow it, follow it, follow it. So let's get some brake fluid in here and see if it actually starts. It's fixed! Ah! Next time on AM Fix It. We have a 1962 AM radio. Our project is to make the radio kind of work Bluetoothy stuff. That kind of hurt. You ever have dreams like where all your teeth have fallen out? Yeah, all the time. <laughs>